ERA is over seven. But Stoltz is the Friday night guy, so may offer something a little bit better. A ground ball to short. Long throw for Jack Haley, and he makes his second play of the night. Turn to double play. For him. Two and two. Flores has a look. Breaking pitch. Comes back in and strikes. Ball. In California, 22 in Texas. Breaking ball. Hit the other way. Fought off by O'Dowd, and he drops it in for a base knock. Jack O'Dowd, sixth hit of the season. A one. Here's the pitch from Stoltz. Changeup gets daily to swing and miss. Two matchup here, lefty on lefty here. While it's hitting 238, gets on the second one, hits a ground ball to the second baseman. And that's easy pick. Oblique, if you want to get technical, gets on the second one and drives to left center, out of Brown's reach, all the way to the left center fence. Between the 385 sign and the Bryan sign, Jack Haley, second pitch, his first at bat of the season. He strokes a double against Michigan, the doubleheader anyway, on Sunday, as Ehrman. Gets on one and strokes it to center with one out. Here comes Haley. Haley will score, and the Titans grab the first run of the night here in the second inning and lead it one to nothing on Lucas Gordon and entire school. Strike three called on a fastball down. Another fastball count. Runs a fastball back inside and walks Caden Connor. Runners are going to take off here on three and two with two out. Osby pitch and Nankill. Hits it in the air to left. Brown comes on and takes care of it. They're, yeah, they're, yeah, right? And then we have a Titan there, Kirk, Kirk Sarlos, uh, coaching there. There's a big shot by Peyton Powell, and he unleashes into the Arboretum for a home run that ties the score here in the third inning. A leadoff shot on a 1-2 pitch. Starting in the batting order tonight. As this one's in the air to right field. Gilmet played for it. Jason Gill over at USC, and he's a Titan. He's in the ground the Big 12, but before that, Mountain West and Whack before that. Eric Kennedy in the air to left center. Sliding catch coming forward, not made by Guzman. Picks the ball up behind him, throws it into second. Kennedy gets his second in. Kind of a dinker. Three and two. He's got to buy your drinks faster now. <laughs> Three, two pitch. Elevated fastball, tagged out into left center, but Colby Wallace moves for it and has, has it for the out. And on Gilmet, Stoltz his next one. In the air to right, carrying a little bit. Nate Nankill going back to the track to run it down in front of the Titan Shop, Texas. Zach Lou on a fastball into right, but Campbell gets there and has it. But I think one of those was the COVID year 2020. Here's a pop-up. Back of the infield, carrying out to short right center. Campbell comes on and has it. Conference portion of play. Inside, Ortega works the wall. Titans in the Big West, the only conference that doesn't have a conference tournament, at least until next year. A ground ball to second, and O'Dowd handles it. Wallace is out at first, and the tides are stopped. Exactly right. 1-1. One, one. Come back or spit out to second base. Lots of having to move quick. Gets the out. One down. They were so stacked. I mean, they went to the <laughs> national final that year. This one's going to be spit back to second out of the reach of Lotza this time. It's going to be a good single there. Titans wanted to ask that first night. Bunting here. It's going to be a hard play for Ehrman. Gets out of the crouch, throws to first. Not in time. His first at bat. At the dish, spits it right back up the middle. That's going to get through. Rounding third is going to be Jack O'Dowd. He's going to come in and score easily, and the Texas Longhorns are right back on top. With that team, because we're going to play forward. Today. Exactly. He does his job yet again up the middle over the jumping lot to rounding third. This time is going to be Daly. Staying at third is Powell, and the Longhorns are just taking command here. Three to one lead. Big swing under the glove of Connor. That's going to score one. Going to third now is Carlson rounding third. And he's going to score easily. And just like that, Eric Kennedy clears the bases. He's at third. It's a 5-1 ball. Variety Campbell. This one's going to be hit straight up to Connor. And he takes care of that one. And Porter Brown, not so sure. Maybe just try to set up that breaking ball, but it missed inside. First pitch to commit. Outside going to second is Brown, and he's going to be hung up there. Pickle might be in place. Tag is going to be laid down after the throw from Lada to Cosball. Swing and a miss there in the dirt, so the ball is going to have to be played at first, and that it is one down to start things off for Luke. 
Spit right back to the pitcher. Gordon's gonna have to move quick. Try to bear a hand. He couldn't get to it. Or rather, couldn't corral it. Team, five RBIs. It's gonna take ball four there. Another one in the dirt, just like that. Titans have two running for the Titans for a bit. Connor is gonna bounce this one out to second. It's gonna be tough to get a double play. They get the out at second. And Connor is in out first. Was well, gonna be a tough double. You very carefully selected. So your eye has to be good. Ball's gonna get past the catcher and Gamet coming in to score, and he does. It is Cole Ehrman. So a bit of a surprise run, but the Titans. No. Yeah, I see how the hospitality was. It's gonna be bang right to the left center gap. That's gonna be in. Coming around to score is Kaden Connor easily rounding first, getting to second. Standing is Nate Nankula, and he delivers another run. 5-3. Lou, the cleanup man. This one's gonna run in and it's gonna plunk him. Thankfully for Lou, it was a breaking ball. So one, two count. Gonna be shot out to left. Backtracking, not gonna get to it in time. That's gonna drop. Rounding third, coming to score is gonna be Lou. Rounding second, deciding to hold back with the bases clearing two run double. The tight ends are right back in the ball game yet again. Five to five. It's gonna ring him up. Max Ortega goes down looking on what he thought was ball four. It's during the pandemic, uh, Augie's book. Spit out to second, Lata's gonna get it on a hop, misplayed it, still has a shot, not gonna be in time. So Mitchell Day, Na 02 national champs, 05 Runner is champs. going to second, it's hard to cut you off there, Mike, and that's gonna be just misplayed at short, but you're exactly right, Garrido. Yeah, they're, they're kind of clean now, punches. Payton Powell out on a breaking ball that found the zip crowd. Healthy crowd on hand for this one. Chopped out to short. Going the quick way to third. Just missed thrown. It was a good idea. Just couldn't get to Zach Lewin. 0-1. It's going to be spit out to second. Lots of takes care of this one. Out to second. Gets the lead runner there. But the runner still comes in to score. And they're calling him out. They're calling him out, not too sure exactly. It's, it's, a, it's an interference call. They call ah. it interference. The run doesn't count, and the inning is over. And the Texas fans are letting them hear it. Hey. So Moises Guzman, the top of the order, gets plunked the first pitch, and uh, first baseman running out first, Moises Guzman, is going to go to second on another ball to Connor. Pitching change right right then going into the break. Attempting the butt here is Nate Nankill and that's a killer of itself. The bunt was right back to the backstop. Do it for you. Exactly right. One, two, has Lou swinging right back to the pitcher. Easy for two, easy for one. That's a double play and the Longhorns. Heritage. Some French Cajun heritage in there. Two and two, swung on and miss and Finchester, Ox. one of the Texas relievers, Austin Wood. As we get the strike out there on Odell, bullpen at all. Different times. Slow ground ball to Jack Haley at short. We'll talk more about that when we come back for the Titan eight. A one, two, three inning by Finch. In the air to right center, Cole Ehrman trying to split the gap. And it has Campbell beat up the alley. Cole Ehrman will race into second with a double to lead off the eighth. Campbell was played in and bunt defense is on for Texas. Guzman turns off that one and took it on the hand. They're going to check about the swing down with the first base. Some could have hit her. I just don't see a bunt. Swings away. The slash on a fairly deep drive to center. Kennedy back on it. Ehrman going to tag up at second and go to third. And it turns into the productive out that Caden Connor double bunt his last time, as Johnny said. One for three tonight. Also hit by a pitch. First one goes to the backstop. And here comes Ehrman trying to beat the throw back. He's safe in the Titans lead. <laughs> on to which teams three and two strike three looking on Nankiel took a fastball bottom half of the zone he thought it was down and out one ball and two strikes has had not played a lot so many guys in front of him swing and a miss Peyton Finchester gets him just to away but he has that under his belt uh medium size two hopper to short Jack Haley over to first two they won here's the two and two pitch swing and a miss he got him with a fastball Finchester and gives the Longhorn sign down to Texas to their dugout. And the Titans get game one here in Fullerton, six to five, the final.